when we started the company, there were four co-founders with me. And they were all people that worked with me in the past. They were either my graduate students or people who worked in my lab. Or in the case of one of our founders, he was a friend, a mentor, an advisor who had built the first fuel cell that ever flew in space in the early 60s, working as a young engineer for GE. So all four of them, when I talked to them and said, this is what we want to do and we want, we want to move to Silicon Valley, they're completely bought into the mission and the vision and said, let's do it. So we had a little garage in which we were doing little things. And John Doerr actually flew in to see that little garage and look at what we were doing uh, before he you know, agreed to invest in Bloom. And he said, how, can, how soon can you get started? We said, how soon can you write the check? And uh, as soon as he wrote the check, uh, within a matter of a week, we unloaded the little garage in Tucson and brought it over to NASA, where NASA was gracious enough to give us a incubation space, which is where Bloom first got started. And it's at Moffett Field. <laughs>